About 30 persons were killed in that robbery operation, while several millions of naira were carted away from five commercial banks. Correspondent Ibrahim Alege has more. It was indeed a well-planned robbery operation. The Daredevil armed robbers started their operation at the Divisional Police Headquarters offer, where they instantly killed 16 persons, 8 policemen and 8 civilians. And simultaneously, the men of the underworld raided the five commercial banks along the popular Owodi Road in Ofa. The robbers were said to be ruthless in their operation as they shot those at the banks without batting an eyelid. Bullet holes and blood stains were left behind by the robbers. It was more than the last one we explained. It was devastating. They brought one of the uh, bank staff from uh, Sokov and they brought him to his car and he was shot there. They were ruthless. They were shooting everybody in the head, you know. Officials of the General Hospital offer refused to speak with us on camera, but TVC News gathered that 21 corpses were taken to the hospital, while nine on danger list were referred to the General Hospital in Lorin. At this private hospital, where one of those who sustained bullet wounds is receiving treatment, three deaths have been recorded. We had about four cases, in which two were brought in dead. On arrival, they are confirmed dead. So we had to send them back. We had one that was brought in, which was, he was severely injured, and he was shot at the head, and the breathing could not be controlled. He also died. But we have, we have one presently in which we had a surgery carried on on him, and his presently recovering. He, he works for the local government. So he normally pays salary to the Olofas Palace uh, staffs, traditional council. He normally pays salary to them. So he, when he paid them the salary yesterday, the balance that was left, he wanted to take it to the bank. It was while he was in the bank that the incident happened. So he was shot. Some dead persons were also said to have been buried, and residents want security of the town to be tightened. But if they have such an equipment, a more personal career, they could repress such a thing. It happened in Ekiru. They dismobilized the uh, Amon personal career in Ekiru. And that of Iraqiji, the next local government came to, to, to rescue them. We are calling up people of like minds, even not only blood, anything they can do to foster the reoccurrence and even to help those people that are, are touched by yesterday's uh, activities. Because it may not necessarily be blood alone. They may need money for drugs. It's indeed a sad period for the people of, of our here in Kwara State. Apart from the money lost to the robbers, about 30 souls were also said to have been lost. And this is not the first time that this is happening in Ofa. Five years ago, a similar occurrence was recorded. Ibrahim Malige, TVC News, Ofa, Kwara State.